So Aero Barrier is a patented product that basically it's a water acrylic based sealant that is aerosolized so it looks like a fog or a mist and they basically take the home or the apartment and you pressurize it with a blower door to 100 pascals of positive pressure and then the heads let off the sealant and that sealant since it's under such pressure gets pushed into anywhere that there's an air gap. So basically all the little gaps whether it be rough openings around windows, bottom plates, top plates, wherever there's air leakage the sealant will go to. The, and you can see the results real time? Correct. So they're able to watch in CFM, cubic feet per minute, of how much the house is leaking. And then they'll know ahead of time, hey, this house needs a 300 CFM blower door. And it's starting at 800 CFM. And they'll watch and the number goes down. They'll seal it down at 250 CFM then break it down, clean up. And then at that point, you're sealed below where you need. And the key is that the builder maintains their air tightness because you can have subs come in, punch holes in you know, the envelope yeah. after so, that. It, so ideally, in that scenario, all our penetrations are completed. Mm -hmm. We're done whatever insulation package we're gonna done. Yep. And our plasterboard or drywall is hung and finished. And then we do the aero barrier. Correct. Before finishes are installed. And, and most importantly, before flooring gets installed. Oh yeah, I can imagine yeah. that. When flooring's installed. That acrylic's gonna stick to that flooring and it's done. That's the one place where the sealant settles. <laughs> is, see, I tell people if it's the rough floor, great, yeah, all good, yeah. doesn't matter. Yeah. But anything like that's in, then it's just a lot of prep, so the price goes way up. And I right. generally tell builders that I don't think it's financially worth it to do it after the fact. Either yeah, do it's it. too hard to prep it. So, if you, so one of the things I learned from you, yourself when I was doing the, my last larger project in Falmouth, and I wouldn't say I was nervous about it reaching the blower door, but I wanted to ensure that I did. As you said, hey, have us come in and do it when you're at plaster, and we're going to quote unquote prove yep. you know, that you're good to go. Yep. And assuming that no one drills any holes in the house after the fact, the electrician didn't forget to put something out or dryer vent or whatever that is, yep. it's going to stay stable with just adding finishes.